just hanging out, trying to get out of the hotel. They want me to get a suit to look like uh, Conor McGregor, but I'm not. I'm not down for that. I'll gonna, stick. I'll gonna stick, stick with the sweat. Uh, yeah, I stick with the sweats and sweater, man. My money doesn't really go to anything besides food. Wings. Oh, they got they got chili cheese fries too. Damn, I'm for sure gotta come here. Funnel kicks. Hell yeah. <laughs> Y'all look so good. I think I might just have to order one of each. <laughs> I love me some food, especially bad food. You want to go in there? Let's go in there. Let's check it out. You look at a suit? Yes, I will look at a suit. Would I get it? Probably not, but I'll look. Tell me what your style is. I don't feel like this is me. Not, not this one, that's for sure. And these colors, that ain't my color. But I'm really curious, can we try, can we put you in one of the Bruce Buffers over here though? <laughs> Try Bruce Booper. That is something he would wear. Oh man. Hey, he's he can dress, man. I just can't do it. I don't know. I don't know why. I wear button-up shirts. I'm so uncomfortable. I tuck in my shirts. The only time I ever tuck in my shirt is for wrestling. Hey, I'm pretty simple, man. I live simple life. Tonight, it's gonna be mostly a weight cutting training session. It's just to keep him busy, keep his body busy, keep on working through the muscle memory of the things that we've worked on, and at the same time, cutting weight. O nosso trabalho é especificamente de ativação. Ativação do corpo do Davidson, né? A gente trabalha com o aquecimento dele, aquecimento, flexibilidade, agilidade, velocidade, né? É, faz ele ativar, faz ele transpirar e a gente passa para os outros treinadores. Então a gente está pronto para nocautear o adversário, se não der para nocautear, vamos finalizar. Mas a luta não vai chegar até o final. Você pode ter certeza disso, que o Deus vai acabar antes do final do quinto round. You know, my goal is to be good everywhere. I don't want to be just like one-sided or do just one thing. Let's start, one, one. And of course, my coach, Pavel Fedotov, is whom I train like all my life. He see small details. And uh, me and my sister, every time given like different situations, what I possible uh, could have during the fight. He can fix like uh, big things by seeing very, very little tiny details. Every fight gives you step forward or some extra opportunity and everything. Especially this fight, of course, is important. I, I need to get this victory. I need to come back on victory uh, side. And I say, how Superman? Second, go. <laughs> Martial arts, it's my life, it's everything for me. Japanese, Japanese. And my goal for for near future is this fight. And of course, I think every fighter in UFC, just their main goal is to be UFC champion because it's the top of the top and everybody wants to be top of the top fighter. You got it? Just don't say it on face, please. Não, essa tem um gostinho especial, assim. Essa é um poster que vai pro, pro quadro e é uma sensação enorme ver eu no pôster, assim. A gente trabalha tantos anos vendo, né, vários posts, várias lutas principais e chegar até aqui é muito especial. Aí deve estar feliz, em algum lugar ele tá. Com certeza, tá todo mundo muito orgulhoso. Você quer me mostrar posters? 
Nah, no, we ain't signed. Where the post is? That's what we got. That's See, look, he lost too, so we all lost. It's something 13, I think. Hey, man, congrats on that knockout, man. Oh, bless you, bless you. Thank you. What's up? Hey, how you doing? Good, man. How are you? Good. Lily signing posters with a dude that I thought I might fight one day. And inspired to be in his position one day. You're at 185, ain't you? Come you on, man. You know, you about bigger than me, though. Your last man. couple of fights was at 85, weren't you? Facts, facts, facts. But 170, though, I'm trying to get in that, too. And, you know, now I'm making that, I'm trying to make this run at 70, so. I feel you. I thought you think you lose to the belt, though, big fella. No, nah, I don't know. I Come on, man. You got to be pretty close. Good. I'm oh, doing okay. good this weekend. I like that. You the guy who just got that knockout. See, after I got that Ellenberg knockout. They don't know my name, though. You know what I'm saying? Nah, they just, I'm just that got that kick. No, but that's OK. <laughs> I'm the guy with the elbow. Yeah, though. I did that elbow. Uh-huh. And I ain't usually right. You could take something like that and just go straight to the title. Great, guys. Thank you very much. Thanks. That's going to be good, man. Good luck with that, Thank bro. You, man. You guys, too, bro. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it. Last time I went over past the stadium and like towards the strip, that's like a couple miles to the strip and then it's like a couple miles back. Oh, put a grab. I just run, look around. I've seen Vegas so many times, but it's like a massage for your body. You know what I mean? You are unforgettable. Sometimes I wonder if I'm a little eager, overzealous, uh, if I'm working too early, if I even have to do this run, does it help keep the cardio up, you know, whatever. I'm not even wasting energy. I don't care. I just, I'm going to just go out here, get loose, and get all the bad out. No need to overdo it. Feel good, though. I like it. We bothering people. They honking at us. You have to wait. You gotta wait for yours out here. My time. Woo! Right, so look at this, man. So you got all the people in the whole thing. Right here on the side of the wall. Yeah. I'm gonna do you doing it, Yes, sir. On what pool? That's legendary right there. I said, that man was something different. He was not out by slapping. Back home is still um, being involved with the process, you know what I mean? Because we still working and we still uh, grinding every single day. So nothing much has changed except I think a lot of people within the UFC know who I am. Definitely since the UFC keep replaying that knockout. How your body feel, Bob? Feel good. Feel good. Yeah. But you know, we are where we want to be right now. You know what I mean? We was working to get in the UFC, so that goal is off the list. You know what I mean? There we go. Right there, just close it down. Yep. Just slow it down now, because ain't no reason to rush. Now it's time to do other things. It's time to mark off other fighters and get to that belt. So, yeah, we're not done yet. The process still going. That's all I had at one point was my shadow boxing when I wasn't able to go into the gym. And I ain't talking about no COVID. So I had to have or ask for, you know what I'm saying, or beg for people like to bring me in. Where, and I wasn't willing to do that. I wasn't willing to beg nobody to uh, bring me into their spot. So I was like, man, I'm going to just do it on my own. And I'm going to be outside, Forest Park, me and my dude, Edric Dillard. And we was working outside, no gym, you know. So we had to find out some creative ways to train, for sure. At the end of the day, this is what we come for. If anybody came at me the same way, I love it, you know? That drives me a lot. When people wanna come and hurt me, make me just wanna hurt you more. And then that's how you get exciting fights, and that's how you get bonuses. I don't wanna fight no scrubs, please. None.